Hi everyone, I'm Jen. Welcome back to my channel. So I need to declutter my closet and also I need to get back into just creative burnout in general. I uh, It's been a couple days since I made anything. It's, it's been a long time since I've had a burnout like this. So um, I really need to just get back in the swing of things. You know, I got ready for the day. I made my bed two big steps you need to do so i'm going to declutter my crocheted pieces first and see what i want to keep what i want to get rid of i don't know how i'm going to get rid of them if i'm just going to throw them out i don't like doing that but like i just just no sight out of mind type of thing you know out of sight out of mind is that how it is that the expression yeah there we go okay so first we're going to start with the closet and then I'm going to go through things that unfortunately did not sell in my shop. And that's going to be a little hard, unfortunately. So I'm going to get a bag. I'm going to go through all the closet. And then we'll get started. My god, this is just my closet. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, Let's see. I'm going to go buy pieces that I just don't want anymore. In all honesty, I really just don't want them. So, first one, off the bat, is a yes. It's, um, I made this during Arizona, and also I finished it here. Uh, this was it back in 2022. I loved it. I, I still love it to this day. It's such a cute, it's a, um, cocoon cardigan, by the way. I was supposed to make a tutorial for this, but I never did. Let me know if I should. Wow, it, it, stitches are so small. It's a five, uh, I used a five millimeter for this. Because I only bought one hook, and then I only bought, uh, like, three skeins of this, and I pretty much used all of them. So, yeah. Okay, um, a shawl that I made, it's, uh, based off of an anime character named Byakuya. Not Byakuya, what? That's my favorite anime character, but it's not him. Um, Bakugo. Bakugo, there we go. He's from uh, My Hero Academia. I don't know why I chose his color palette, but I guess because I was I needed to use orange and and uh, emerald. So I think I'm gonna. Uh, I want to sell, but nothing sells in my shop, and that's the problem. I think it's also because I just don't. I don't advertise my shop. I don't. I, uh, I don't know. I, I guess I'll keep it and see what happens. This was for my Togekiss cosplay for anime New York City 2022. This is, this is a yes. My first no. This was a sweater gone wrong. It's like, it looks like a Snuggie at this point and this is definitely a no because it is coming apart. This is a no. We're getting rid of it. Okay, this is definitely a no. This is one of the first tops I ever made. Well, one of them in this style. Um, it doesn't fit me. At all. I remember when I put it on, I was like, why did I keep this? This is unfortunately I uh, get rid of. Because I actually ran out of purple. And now and it was just too big on me. Like from the shoulders. It's cute. Color palette's cool, but it doesn't fit me. Ah, we're losing already. Okay. First shawl I ever made. I need to make a video about my shawls. Here we go. First shawl I ever made. Literally my second project I ever finished, actually. I love it. Same, uh, same yarn as the cocoon cardigan that you saw earlier. This is a yes, obviously. Have to keep it. Ugh. This, this one. This was my first Halloween project. Uh, this was a shawl that I made. But I was, it was my first time experimenting with a hood. And unfortunately it didn't work out. Um, I think I'm going to get rid of this one only because the hood did not work out very well. 
it didn't come out good at all. So unfortunately, this is a goodbye. Oh my god, this one was so cute. This is this is um this is a top that I made. Super cute. It I think it still does fit me. I'm pretty sure this does I'm pretty sure this still fits me. But I have to retry it on first. I don't wanna I don't really want to try anything on right now, so. Uh, maybe oh, maybe I can make a new one. You know what? Yeah, I'll make a new one. This is a get this is a no. This is a get rid of. I have no attachment. This is a vest that I made, a granny square vest that I made. It's it's cropped. It's cute. Um I think I'm phasing out of it though. It's just not something I just don't want. This sweater I've worn twice already. Um I'm going to get rid of it. I'm gonna make something new for Christmas this year. This was one of the first t-shirts I ever made or attempted, so this is a uh, no keep. This is a get rid of. I don't have an attachment to it anymore. I'm just I only keep it because it was it was sentimental because it was my first thing. It was like my first, you know, item. All right, this is a yes. I wear this all the time. I love it. I still love this vest. I can't get rid of it. I, I love it to death. We have to keep this. Ah. Uh, I love this cardigan. Technically a Halloween cardigan. Yes, we have to keep this. We have to keep it. I love it so much. I love it so much. Um, this is a granny square bikini that I made. Um, it was too big. I never really posted it anywhere, but I'm not... I'm not gonna keep it. Okay, my first experimenting with mesh. It was supposed to be like... A short sleeve, like... I don't know how to explain it, but... You know. It's like a cardigan, but it was kind of long. Kind of short, I don't know. It's okay, I'm not keeping it i'm not keeping this ah my first granny square shorts okay these are too big i can't wear them maybe i mean i gained a little bit of weight maybe i can wear them but uh, uh, i don't know nah i'm not i'm just not i just can't do it i'm sorry i just can't do it <laughs> This one I made, this was my first Granny Square t-shirt. I mean, I like it. I love the colors, my favorite colors, but it just was actually too small on me. So we're getting rid of it. And then the last thing in my closet, Granny Square vest. I want to make another one. I think I'm going to get rid of it for now. We're, we're going to make a new one. Yeah, we're definitely going to make a new one. So that's all I have in my closet. Wow, that's a lot actually. But now I have to go through stuff that's in my yarn, my yarn loft. I have things over here that I can get rid of too. So let me just get that. Spoiler, I was working on a concert uh, outfit and I don't like the way the direction is going. So I got rid of it and I started over. I was making a hood. I was making a hood for it. It just, I don't like it. I, I, I feel bad. I worked, I worked hard on the squares, but I just, I don't know. It was supposed to be like a long vest and I ended up not liking it. Oh well, don't like it, goodbye. Two bags full, oh my God. I haven't even gone upstairs yet, that's crazy. That's absolutely crazy. Oh my god. I haven't gone upstairs yet. Um, everything that's on my chair right now, I, I'm i definitely keeping, but I mean, it's still, in, it's in the shop. Like this hood? 
the rainbow hood. Is this the original hood? This is my thumbnail for my for my um crochet hood tutorial. Have to keep it. I have to keep this. I, I love it. It's one of my favorites. So on my like junk chair, I have an all and a bunch of things I have to declutter on my desk. Um bisexual scarf transgender flag scarf and pansexual flag scarf are in my etsy shop gender fluid scarf has not been listed yet and my rainbow one that is my personal one so i don't ugh. it's getting warmer now but i have i need i want to sell these they're still in my shop i'm kind of decluttering a lot of my stuff but i can't get rid of them right now i work really hard on them and i love selling pride merch I really do. It's one of my favorite things to it's one of my favorite things to make ever is pride stuff. Like I love this rainbow shawl. I wanna make other flags. Maybe I'll be able to for a pride this year, but I don't know. I have all of this too that I have to go through and see what, what um what's in them. I don't even know what's in them. Okay, this is just yarn that I have to put back on my shelf. And this is like current work. I think this is current work in progress. Yep, there. That's current. That's my current stuff. And then this. I think this was my. Oh yes, yes. This is a part of my. I can get rid of this. I'm still working on my my outfit for my concert that I'm going to in May. I can get rid of this. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, let's go upstairs. I'm I'm scared. Oh my god <laughs> it's gotten so bad up here i'm not ashamed to even show this to anybody but i can't believe how bad it's gotten up here i have a bunch of stuff that was in my shop that i took out i'm gonna get rid of stuff that's currently in my shop i need to reorganize all of my shipping supplies are chilling up here i can probably get rid of half of this stuff but like ugh. Uh. I don't know what to do. At least my yarn is organized. My yarn is pretty much organized. Um, it's just I have to get rid of some stuff up here. It's it's gotten so bad. Oh my god. I have to get I have to get garbage bags and look through everything in here. I can't believe how bad this is. I brought the whole garbage roll this time, so um yeah. Let's do it. I don't know where to start. I've been meaning to do this for so long. I guess whatever's in front of me right now, I'm gonna start. If I don't have an attachment to it, I'm getting rid of it. Um, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, first thing, okay. A plushie that I have, uh, I made while well, trying to. Eh, nope. 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 Goodbye. A pillow. This needs an entirely separate bag. Will it even fit? Yes, it will. Not well, though. I might be able to use this in my room, actually. I might be able to use this. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to put this in my bedroom. Because we've been looking for a pillow to still lay on. For like behind us in the window. Like against the window. You know what? Yes, we're keeping that. Oh, my first uh, snood. My first Wednesday snood that I ever made. My One of my, my second most popular video. My first video that ever popped off on YouTube. Super exciting. But, um, I have, I still have the other one, actually. Yeah, I do. Okay, I have another one. I'm gonna keep both of them, the, the other two, though. When I was first making my hood pattern, this is what it used to be. <laughs> this is what it used to look like, so. Goodbye. Bags that I used to sell. Not anymore. Uh, 
And now we have a bag, like a bin that's empty. That's so great. Oh my gosh. Okay. I should keep everything that I'm keeping in here for now. Okay. Whatever is on, oh, whatever is on my, uh, my shelf. Um, obviously we're keeping stuff that I got from another YouTuber slash shop owner tiktoker instagrammer i've become good uh friends with i would say uh, you know haven't talked to her in a while if she watches this hi <laughs> i still have all of your things that you ever made me she's the person that kind of got me almost into like her like documenting my crochet stuff so um i thank her a lot for it she does mostly on the groomy I cannot do amigurumi, uh, I can't do it. So she's really good at what she does and makes a lot of pride merch, so. I just wanna shout her out because I love her, so. <laughs> okay, keeping. Okay, first big octopus I ever made. It's in black, uh, made with sweet and snuggle yarn. I don't have any big uh, eyes. So, yeah, we're keeping, we're keeping him. I love him so much. First frog. Nope. Derpy frog. Nope. Keeping. This is from Crochet Co. I think that's, I think that's her name. Crochet Co. Yeah, Crochet Co. Super cute, it's an orange. I love her blobs. I don't know if this person still creates or sells things, I think they do. Uh, I think her name is Phoebe Plushes. Probably one of the first uh, crochet plushies I ever, I ever bought. And uh, this this little guy got me through when I, when I had COVID for the first time, keeping. Made this uh, while I was blowing up on TikTok, so it's a it's a weird looking apple. No. Chickens. Um. Yeah, we can keep these. They're su they're super cute. Cloud puff plushie. Nah. Just not feeling it. Pumpkin plushie. This is my first video on my YouTube channel, actually. My uh, speed make of making this pumpkin. Um, this is when I was in my hand knitting phase, you know, with no hook or needles. It's, big, it's used with big chunky yarn by Bacozzi. Well, from Bacozzi, they're based in uh, Michigan. So, yes. Keeping. I love it. Love the company. Okay. We're getting closer, but I can't ignore this bag. It's right in front of me. This is gonna be a hard one. Frog. Frog hood. Um, I'm not really attached to it, so this is a get rid of. I need to open another bag. Next. Frog hood number one that I ever made. I'm not attached to it. I'm sorry. I have a tutorial for it, but I'm just not attached to it anymore. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Failed chainsaw. Oh, what the heck? Okay. Failed chainsaw uh, man themed hood. It's, it's based off of Pochita. This is a no. Okay, here we go. Uh, lesbian thing, lesbian flag hat. I think I'm gonna remake them. I'm gonna remake a bunch of stuff for Fried this year, so this is a no. This is my personal hat, actually, I believe. I'm pretty sure this is my personal hat. 
I'm gonna remake a bunch of my hats. This is a no. One of my favorite, this is my, my tutorial hood keeping. Ah, the, the, uh, the pink and yellow. This is my strawberry, uh, not strawberry, pink lemonade hood. Um, this is a no, I can get rid of this. Pride flag hoods as a keep. I want to try and, and uh, sell them this year. I really want to try and sell all of my pride hoods. Like that was non-binary. This is asexual. This is lesbian. This is a romantic. This is a gender. I got all the A's. Except for uh, Arrow Ace, I didn't do. This is my personal one. So, this is my personal, this is my flag. So, that's a keep. Okay, uh, my second hat I ever did, like, for the beanie, this is a no. The first beanie I ever made, super huge. A lot of people ended up liking it. <laughs> um, unfortunately, this is not a keep. Um, this is a no, this is what I use for my tutorial. I'm just not into the style anymore. Same thing, this is a no. I have learned how to remake the hats, like, properly. My very first bucket hat, it looks so cute on me, actually. It's really cute on me, but this is a no. Um, hat? Cat beanie? No. Halloween cat beanie? It doesn't fit me. It doesn't fit me properly. No. This one actually fits me. This is a no. Rainbow hats uh, is a no. I just don't like them anymore. Hochita hat. Um, I think I made a better one. It's chilling right over there. So this is, uh, you know what? I think I'll keep it. I think I'll keep this one. It is cute. And then this actually might be mine, my personal one. I don't remember. I know I said the other one was, but I think this might actually be my personal one. Yeah, it is. This is my personal one. This one fits better. Keep. A tote bag done! Yay! All right. All right. Time to go through more stuff. Yay. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I feel a little bit more inspired now that I am decluttering, I'm not gonna lie. I did get rid of a lot. Um, there's still things that I need to actually get rid of, though. There's a lot in here that I need to get rid of, and just go through and just be like, no, I don't want it, meh, goodbye. We so far have about four bags, almost four bags of stuff that I'm getting rid of, which is depressing, but it is what it is. Obviously, we are keeping stuffing, even though I don't do amigurumi that often. Look at how much I still have left. It's 
great. I still have a lot left. Okay. Um, pom pom maker. I don't know what to do with this yet. My temperature scarf that I finished. This is my 2023 temperature scarf. I am keeping this. I want to show it off again in the summer because it was freezing when I finished it. So, keeping. Here we go, another bag. Okay, this is my broken hexagon cardigan from Halloween. Unfortunately, I have to get rid of. I get rid of. This is was that was my tutorial for my knitting machine scarf tutorial. Can definitely get rid of it. A bunch of these I can get rid of actually. This is a theme scarf that I made. Another theme scarf, which is actually on my channel. This is my Todoroki scarf. Shoto Todoroki. Another uh, uh, knitting machine tutorial. Never sold, unfortunately. Never sold. Look at that, I have, I have an empty, uh, I have an empty shelf, that's great. This cardigan, I think I'm gonna keep this. I like the color. This is like a this is the uh, dark rainbow hexagon cardigan. I can pro I can definitely keep it. This is my hexagon my Halloween themed hexagon sweater. I don't like the way the colors came out, so this is a no. And we have another empty tote. Um, let's get rid of. Let's do this one. Barbie themed hexagon sweater. I think I'm gonna keep this one. This one came out really cute. I'll keep it. My very first hexagon sweater is unfortunately coming apart. I unfortunately cannot wear this anymore, so I cannot keep it. Another uh, item that the Mary J made for me, I need to keep this. Okay, Joseph Joestar scarf, we're keeping this. My Wednesday snood, keep. My Enid snood, keep. Thank you for blowing this up on my channel. <laughs> my rainbow scarf, uh, get rid of. Um, half blue, half yellow scarf was an experiment. Get rid of. I should have made this for a video, but this was something that my fiance picked the colors for, so goodbye. A scarf made of discontinued yarn. Goodbye. Joseph Joe Star scarf keeping. This is um, My Hero Academia themed scarf again, but this is the one that Izuku Midoriya wore. Um, he loves All Might, and this is like an All Might themed scarf from an episode, so keeping. Bakugo scarf, uh, I can get rid of. There's more, oh my god. Hand knit pillow. No. Um. Big stocking. Why is it here? I'm gonna get rid of. A backpack. My old backpack. Is it completely empty? I have to check. 
I think it is. I could probably get rid of this. Oh, there's stuff in here. Oh my gosh, there's stuff in here still. Oh my god, this is from when I was uh, still in nursing school. Oh my god. No way. This is one of when I was about to like go into the program. So get rid of. Um, backpack we can also get rid of because I'm not using it anymore. It's just... I'm not using it. I don't like the color, it's dirty. I have four bags. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm not done. This is gonna take forever. I don't know, I'm gonna do some stuff off camera because this is gonna be a really long video. If you're into that type of thing, I don't know. Oh my God, I have a floor. This is stuff that I'm bringing downstairs. Oh my God, look. A lot of stuff has been moved. I've gotten rid of a lot. Oh my God. I wanna get rid of this mirror. Look at this. It looks so much better. It seriously looks so much better in here. I got rid of stuff that I no longer sell. Stuff that I want to put on Etsy. Um, I, ha I have a lot of shipping supplies still. I'm going to keep for now. My, my crochet box. My crochet hooks. My temperature scarf. I now have a place for my, uh, for extender. This is, uh, well, extension cord and my yarn winder. My ladder is there because I can't reach my yarn because I'm short. But yeah, I just have to vacuum up here. Um, my dad's going to have to help me with the vacuum because it's heavy. But yeah, I have stuff that I need to just put downstairs i have to reorganize a little bit but that's really about it i'm done i can't believe it i i feel so much better i feel a bit inspired so um yeah let's do something else now finished my project that I was working on. I This is my first project I finished in like five days. So it's a cat beanie. First time double stranding for a cat beanie. I'm using Red Heart Super Saver uh, Favorite Stripes. I have two more skeins of these and then I'm just using white. I wanted to do black but I was running out of black. I'm using it for a project so. Okay let's see how this works. I don't even know how many rows this is. <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight rows. It's huge. It's huge on me. All right, let's do this. Right? Um, not 
bad. It's not good, but it's not bad. It's my first project that I've done in a while, so. All right. Feel good? I have a project over here as well. It's a um, really cool scarf looking thing, so. It's nowhere near done, by the way. It's nowhere near done. <laughs> This is not going to get finished for a while, so that's not. I'm not going to include this in in this video today. So, all right, I think that's it for today's video. I feel good. I decluttered a lot. You know, I I have a lot of garbage I have to take out, though. That's the problem. All right. Um. Thank you all so much for watching today's video. I appreciate it, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.